But of course, professional boxing, an entirely different prospect than amateur boxing. And it has been kind to Mike Tyson. Here we go. He is a fast starter. One thing we should mention, Jimmy, before the action heats up too much is this is a 16 foot ring, very much to Tyson's liking. Starting out, going to the body, and already Ferguson has lasted longer than have some of Tyson's 12 first round knockout victims. But now, Tyson got an uppercut through the guard. Punch. And one of the things that distinguishes him, even in the amateurs, Mike Tyson can throw great body shots. He takes what you give him, and right now Jesse Ferguson is, Ferguson is just giving him the body. We saw a few seconds ago one of the things that makes Tyson so special. He threw a tremendous left hook, missed with it, and didn't go off balance. Always in position to punch. You would find almost no one in the arena who believed before this began that it would go to a decision. Ferguson in his 10-round loss to Carl the Truth Williams a TKO defeat, not a decision. Was in trouble in both the first and tenth rounds, and now he's in trouble here. Blood coming out from the nose of Jesse Ferguson. The right uppercut of Tyson has put him down. Six, seven, eight. Up at nine is Jesse Ferguson. I think that uppercut broke Ferguson's nose, Jim. He is in desperate trouble. He will not last much longer. stopped it there. Mike Tyson's known as a great finisher. Let's see how he does with Ferguson. Ferguson gamely hanging in, having trouble covering up. Four seconds, three seconds. And Jesse Ferguson barely made it out of round five. Tyson punching from very close quarters. The, the obvious punch right here is the uppercut. He turns around. Digs right to the body and then comes straight up with the right uppercut. Tyson has a tendency to turn left-handed. He turned left-handed to, la to land that combination. Beginning of round six. First time as a professional Tyson's ever been in this round. Ferguson trying to jab. Every great champion has to know how to finish an opponent when he has him hurt. Jesse Ferguson is hurt. Let's see how Mike Tyson does to take him out. The left hook did some damage. Jesse Ferguson not taking the break, holding on to Tyson's left hand. He's just going to hold until Rivera has to absolutely pry them apart. It's not going to be enough for Rivera to say break. He's going to have to get in there and force him apart. Another left. Delivered in close quarters. Continue to hold until he's, he just physically forces him out. Can't say I blame him. The only thing Rivera can do is what he just did. Give him a warning. And take points away if he continues to do it. Tyson's making a mistake by letting himself get this close to Ferguson. He must maintain a little bit of distance so that Fer he's going he's to take a point. He's disqualifying him. He disqualified Jesse Ferguson. 